Question 12. Solve the inequality 2x plus 13 is greater than or equal to 6. So we rearrange the inequality just like we would an equation, except we've got to be careful because if we ever multiply or divide by a negative number, that will make the inequality change direction. However, in this case, we don't have to worry about that. We take away both side, take away 13 away from both sides, and we're going to end up with 2x is greater than or equal to minus 7. And then when we divide both sides by 2, we're going to end up with x is greater than or equal to negative 3.5. So that's our answer for that. So part 2, n is a negative integer. That means it is a whole number that is negative. Write down all the possible values of n which satisfy this. Now, when it says values of n, it's basically the same thing as far as the x that we've just figured out, except it's got an n instead. So if we think about all the values that are bigger than negative 3.5, which of those are negative integers? Well, the whole number that's just bigger than negative 3.5 is negative 3. Then we have negative 2. Then we have negative 1, and that's it. There are no other negative integers after that because it becomes zero then positive so minus three minus two and minus one are the values of n which um satisfy this equation which basically means it's, it's what works out of that